All right, so to provide a little context for our tomahawk tool, let's just quickly review how to bisect an angle. So bisect means to cut in half, and there's a couple different ways to do that using just a compass and a straight edge. So what I would consider the traditional method begins by placing the tip of your compass on the vertex of your angle here, and I just made a 60 degree angle. And then we're going to make an arc that passes through the two rays of the angle and the radius of that arc is arbitrary. So we'll go ahead and just make an arc here. And I tell the students that, let's just suppose that the vertex is home plate. This point where the arc hits the, ver the uh, ray is like first base. And then this point where the arc hits the other ray is like third base. So what we need to do is we need to locate second base. So second base is gonna be out here somewhere. So to do that, we're gonna keep the radius of our compass the same. And I'm just going to move the compass onto first base and make an arc out here in the outfield. And then place the tip of the compass on third base and make another arc in the outfield. And then where those two arcs intersect, that is in a sense, second base. And then all you need to do is line up your straight edge with home plate and that second base mark. And I tell the students just hit one right up the middle. And then when you draw that ray, that's an angle bisector. So now their 60 degree angle has been cut into two 30 degree angles. So I guess I would consider that to be the traditional method for bisecting ang an angle. Another version, which I think is pretty nice, I just learned this method a couple of years ago, starts the same way. We're gonna make an arbitrary radius uh, and then make an arc that passes through the two rays of the angle, all right? And now I'm going to extend beyond that one to another arbitrary radius, all right? And those don't have to be in any particular ratio. They're just two arbitrary arcs. And then all you do is you take your straight edge and I'm going to start here and connect to here. And then I'm going to start here and connect to here. So this is gonna make an X in the interior of the angle. And then to draw your angle bisector, just connect the vertex through the intersection of those two segments. So now you have two 30 degree angles, which comprise that 60 degree angle. So there's a little context for angle bisectors. So uh, there's been a number of ways to uh, possibly trisect an angle, but uh, using a compass and straight edge that is not possible. So a couple different tools have been created. And in this Instructable, I'm going to show you how to create a tomahawk, which is a tool that is used to trisect an angle. So it doesn't construct it using a compass and straight edge, but it, you can create this really simple tool with paper or cardstock, or I'm gonna show you an index card, and you can use that as a tool to trisect an angle.